Hello, this is Ernie again, and this is a quickie tip on how to position your antennas when you use an IEM that's rack mountable with quarter inch, not quarter inch, but quarter wave or half wave antennas. Here is a IEM digital that runs on two channels. This one's currently going on 909 and 922 megahertz and here's the antenna farm in the back of the short rack it's a little mess here there's one two three four four five uh six seven seven antennas back here and these are all the receiving antennas for the wireless mic okay so we're not going to mess with that now we're going to talk about the transmission mic uh, trans transmission antenna for the IEM let me clean this up a little bit pardon me by doing this I don't want to waste any of your time your valuable time okay so now we are left with the two antennas for transmission Okay, this is not the position, ideal position to have your antennas for your IEM. Your best bet is to have them up and intersecting with each other like that. Why? It's because the antennas aren't taking a re receiving job. They're, they're transmitting. This thing is transmitting a signal out to your receiver. So a transmitting signal is a, is a circular round coil that goes up in the air. Okay, so if when you have it like this, it's gonna, it may avoid being picked up by the receiver. So your best bet is to have it like this, going up this way, so your receiver will have a better chance of grabbing both signals. Or you can do it this way. Have it sticking out. So the both of the transmitting antennas doing their circle will, will go out. Now, if you noticed during NFL games or games with um, professional NBA basketball, they use IEMs at the stadium, and they need a good, good um, transmission. Nothing like this. Nothing Mickey Mouse like a uh, half-wave antenna. So they use a professional um, transmitting antenna. It kind of looks like a dome. It's a half dome that shoots out the circled uh, transmission going outwards. Anyway, so let's try it now. Let's put a song on. This one's called Aliens Exist. I think it's, it's by Blink-182, I believe. Okay, it's coming out really good. It's a good signal. You can't really hear, but it, anyway, it's coming out really well. So the, when I do it this way, it started cutting out a little bit. And it's not... It's, it's even worse when it comes down here like this. A lot of distortion. And it's popping up. The sound is going loud, soft, loud, soft. So when you bring it out like this, it evens out the transmission. Now it's good. That's a good transmission. And it's, you can't hear it because you're not here in this room. But in the other room, it's, it's coming out really well. Or, like I said, you bring it up and you intersect the antennas at the tip like this and now it's really good this so you got your two choices either out up intersection out this way or up intersecting each other and for me that's the best way that works for me if you have other ways that you use your antennas to transmit for a good signal let me know Anyway, we'll check you out later. This is DJ Ernie. Have a great new year. Take it easy.